So my dudes, Val here, and today I'm going to be talking about why you should never go to level 80. So what do I mean? Am I saying to never level up your characters? No, I'm saying to not go from 70 to 80. I think you should always do the final ascension because it gives you access to the final trace, but 70 to 80 is a massive, massive resource sink for not that much of a return. Let me show you guys exactly what I mean. So here I have Bailu and Yangqing set up. I'm using Star Rail Station for this, by the way, because I love to use Star Rail Station to plan out my characters. You can see my Yukong Locha here. Uh, but I have Yangqing and Bailu set up because I want to showcase the difference in completely maxing a character by just not taking them to 80. So here you can see Bailu is level 1 to 80, fully maxing a character, 5.7 million XP. Um, it takes 4 million credits. Uh, 300 almost 300 purple books and then a bunch of resources you can see here now I have Yang Ching set up to the exact same amount the exact same literally the exact same and the only thing I have different on Yang Ching is I didn't put him to level 80 so there's a couple traces you can't get because you need to be level 80 to get every trace but you can see the difference here the difference in XP is almost half 3 million versus 5.8 million and then the credit cost is 3.3 million versus 4 million well 3.9 million but same thing and then the purple book cost is 1 151 versus 289 once again almost half the amount of resources whenever it comes purely in terms of leveling and trust me i'm saying this as a guy who plans on level 80 every single character in the game you can see every single character I will plan, or I do plan on getting them all level 80 soon enough. Um, here, you can see here. Everybody is on their way to getting level 80. Everybody's level 70 at least. Arlen's the last one to go. And then I'm going to work on getting everybody 80. But I can tell you guys from personal experience, it's not that big of an increase in stats. So if I take a level 80 character that I have that I have like no relics on, I'm sure there's one around here somewhere. Um, <laughs> one second. I gotta find a level 80 that I basically have like zero relics on to show you guys the like virtual difference of it. All right, so this took a second, but now I put Yang Ching on just some random light cone that's level one. I took off all of his relics except this one because it's just ice damage. It gives a little bit of HP, but in the end, it's not really messing with any stats, so I don't have to mess too much back. And now I have Gamba Girl here. So Yang Ching versus Gamba Girl. You can see the stats are almost identical between level 80, level 85 star, and level 74 star. Now, that being said, relics do push this up a lot higher. Um, relics do end up taking these base stats and sending them to the moon, so this pro this difference, this gap does get like shown a lot more, but in the end, it's not a lot of stats. It's really not a lot of difference. So you can get a character like this to where you have all their stars unlocked, so you can get the final trace, so you can go ahead and get this whenever you want, uh, because this final trace ability is almost always really, really strong without spending about double the resources to get not that much return. Level 80 just isn't worth it at all at all in my opinion. I think level 80 is a giant waste of resources as somebody that has a ton of level 80 characters. Trust me, level 80 is not worth it. It's not. Don't do it. Don't level your characters. I don't know what I'm going to title this video. It'll probably be that. Uh, but it's just not worth it. Anyways, that's the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you guys agree with me? Disagree with me? Would you guys level your characters to 80? I don't think you should as somebody that's doing it actively. Let me know what you think. Other than that, thank you guys for watching as always. Hopefully you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.